Hello Sagittarius, this is your you versus them reading for the 12th through the 18th. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what's been going on with you guys. Six of Swords, moving away. Some of you, some of you are traveling, have been traveling. Um... Uh, I feel like a lot of you guys may be like out on, or some of you, not a lot of you, some of you are out um, like on the water or either have somebody else that's out on the water, maybe working and there's some conflict there, um, not really knowing what the other person is doing, this, that, and the other. Um, and I think there's a lot of, of like, you know, ruminating thoughts surrounding what this person is actually doing for some of you. Okay, um, for others of you, I think you guys have like you're just trying to move past the hurt that you guys have experienced in the past, and um, and you're really trying to you know remove your emotions from this situation at this point. Think about things logically and and what you need to do to get past something here. Okay, trying to gain some balance and harmony in your life is what I'm getting for you guys. Okay. So let's see what's going on or what's been going on with them. Let's see what's been going on with them here. The lovers. Okay. Um, they're either hmm. Hmm hmm. Either this person is making a choice or trying to make a choice. Or has made a choice between either of those scenarios because you know time is kind of fluid all right so this person either made a choice between you and themselves like deciding to be free be single or they made a choice between you guys and someone else okay for some of you um, and then for others of you, this person has made a choice between themselves, you, and someone else, okay, and chose themselves here. And there are actually two people in this scenario that have been hurt by this decision. It's just what I'm getting, I know, but it is what it is, guys, okay? But, um, yeah. Okay, so let's pull some more cards and see where this story goes. As I cut the deck, I see the two of cups here for you guys. Um, feeling very attached to this person. Um, having this this undeniable, feeling this undeniable, oh goodness, connection with this person. Love. I feel like this person loves you too. Okay. So let's see what's blocking you guys or keeping you from them. Let's see what's keeping you guys from each other right now for you I think that you are on this quest to um, just be by yourself honestly okay to be by yourself and and there has been a lack of forward movement with you guys so I think that right now you're just really using your logic to kind of move on past this situation Okay, and then for, for others of you, the first scenario where you were feeling like somebody was like off, like on the water or, you know, and, and maybe doing something or communicating with other people. I don't feel that. I don't feel that. <laughs> I feel like this person is all about um, just being successful. Maybe they are so like into their work or into whatever it is that they're doing um, that they are just so focused on that. Um, but I don't, I don't feel that energy of them like really like doing anything with anyone, okay, or talking to anyone. I don't get that. So that is that story. All right. So let's see was keeping them from you. <clears throat> the Empress. Hmm. Um, for a lot of you guys, this person has 
someone else in the picture, okay? Somebody else that they have started over with. Gemini energies here. Um, Taurus, Libra, Aries energy. Okay. For a lot of you, they've started over. Um, and then for others of you, this person has chosen themselves and they're just um, they're just trying to just be happy. Uh, they want growth in their life and, and possibly felt like they couldn't do that being in a connection here okay what's currently going on for Sagittarius what's currently going on for Sagittarius huh all right one more shuffle because those cards were not wanting to come together I feel a lot of disappointment coming from you guys choosing a different path um, but you're at a crossroads right now I feel but definitely, you know, choosing, trying to choose, you know, what is best for you. What's going to bring you harmony um, and success in your life. Okay, definitely. Hmm. Aries energy there. Let's see. <clears throat> What's currently going on for them? Trying to be happy. Trying to be happy, awakening. Um, some of them, again, like I said, are actually, you know, in a new relationship where they feel happy. Um, for others of them who have chosen themselves, they are um, just feeling happy within themselves, doing the things that they feel like is going to bring them growth and abundance and success in their life as a single person um this person the single person is is nine times out of ten a single parent single mother single father and um you know they're just they're doing new things basically taking care of their family hmm. <clears throat> influencing sagittarius here what is influencing sagittarius here Influencing Sagittarius. Looking for the one. Looking for the one. Trying to find out what is the be best and right path for you. Okay? Reflecting. Reflecting on situations. Reflecting on situations with people. Um, intimate relationships. And um, in quest of the one, I feel. Um, for this individual at the bottom, the five of pentacles flipped out there. As far as their influence, this person feels, I, I'm feeling rejected. Okay. Um, feeling hurt here. I feel like this person expected to be with you guys. Okay. And something happened here and either you or them, um, had to leave. One of the two. But nevertheless, um, somebody was very hurt here, if not both of you, in this situation. And somebody cannot, I feel, get past that. They're having a hard time getting past that. Taurus energy there. What's coming in for Sagittarius? What's coming in for Sagittarius? enlightenment the truth um victory okay i think you're going you're going to definitely start seeing things very clearly about yourself about your situation about you know this individual even um i, I do see success in your story here with the chariot and the ace of swords you're definitely um you're going i feel like you're doing the right things I feel like you're going down the right path um, because I see you looking for the truth in situations, looking for what's right, for what's real. And I, and I feel you like progressing here. Definitely. Look at this. Your destiny. Your right, the right path, the star. 
healing. You're going to find it. It's coming. Keep doing what you're doing, okay? You're on the right track. Some of you need to hear that. Let's see what's coming in from Darren. And you guys know the hermit is looking for the star. He's trying to find his path. He's trying to find his way. You know, what's, what's right for him or her. Temperance. Healing. Balance. Harmony. Happiness is what's coming in for this person. Um, for a lot of you guys, this is also reuniting. Reuniting. Okay. Okay. For some of you, if this person is single, I, I definitely see them, you know, getting happy in their life. Um, and if they are with someone, I definitely see them, you know, being happy in that connection as well. Okay. So I see good things for them. There's still just a lot of hurt, I think, you guys share between the two of you. I don't see any bad cards here. I just don't know if this energy is bringing you guys towards each other or leading you down a different path. Okay. So let's see what's blocking you. As I cut the deck, I see the four of wands there. Maybe this person has recently gotten married or, or are in a long-term relationship here. Let's see what's blocking Sagittarius from this person. What's blocking Sagittarius from this person? The King of Cups. Maybe it's the fact that this person's not offering their love to you. Their focus is somewhere else. They haven't acknowledged you. Scorpio energy there, I feel. Let's see what's blocking <clears throat> this person from Sagittarius. What's blocking them? The card fell out right there. The Hierophant. Like I said, um, strong Taurus energy here in the center of your reading. Either this person is married or they are just so stubborn and set in their ways, which, you know, I don't see this situation as a horrible thing. Um, they may just have a certain standard for themselves. They may feel that, you know, too much has happened here. They've been too hurt to not want to revisit it. Okay. Just kind of, you know, standing by what they believe, standing by their truth. Okay. So they may just be unwilling to bend is what this person um, is blocking them from coming towards you. They have a certain standard if they're single. Okay. But again, this person could definitely be married or in a very committed relationship already. Let's see what the advice is for Sagittarius. What's the advice for Sagittarius? Keep going. Keep going. Be confident. Um, know that you're going towards success. Know that you will be victorious in this situation with or without this person. Okay? Most definitely. I definitely see that. You will be successful with or without this person. The advice for them. Turn those cards. Oh yeah, I've turned the cards upside down. So <clears throat> the tower. I I do think this person has walls up. Okay, they have walls up, and um, in order, if this person is single, for the single person here, they need to. Um, kind of let go of certain certain things that are just not serving them that are just not good for them um i, I kind of feel like they're blocking themselves here if they're single um not really want to see the truth in this situation having these thoughts and actions that are just not beneficial 
to be in a relationship. Okay? Um, if they are actually connected with someone, then the advice would be that they need to break up. That they need to let that go. In order for them to come towards you. You know, that, that will be the thing. If they're with someone or marry then of course in order for them to come towards you and you guys be able to have something then they would have to like you know disconnect from someone else here but definitely if they're single i think there's some walls that need to come down because those walls don't have any plaster they don't have any two by fours it's like you know it needs to go and be rebuilt Okay, so let's see what the outcome is for you guys here. What is the outcome for Sagittarius? You leave behind that energy. Um, things that are not serving you anymore. If it's not, if you feel like, you know, staying in this or thinking about this or wondering if this person is coming back, all of that, I feel like you guys, you know, you'll let that go. You'll slough that off. Let that go, you know, uh, and move towards things that really make you happy. Going towards your nine of cups here. Okay, this is the eight of cups walking away. You're going towards your nine of cups. You're going towards your wish fulfillment. That's what you guys are doing. Okay going towards your happiness what is the outcome for them what is the outcome for them two of wands being at a crossroads looking back looking back at the past looking back at things that um were broken you know reflecting I feel like this person's definitely coming to a point where they are rethinking this connection with you. If they are with someone else, this person is, is going to um, start thinking about whether or not they are in the right connection. Okay. They have a lot on their plate to think about, to decide here. Because if they're with someone else, they're thinking about breaking up. They're thinking about cutting this person loose. If they are single, if this is a single person, then they're thinking about, you know, did I do the right thing? Um, should I let my guard down a little bit? You know, is that really true what I'm thinking about them? Um, do I have some responsibility in, you know, what happened here? Should I revisit this situation? That sort of thing, okay? So we have Aries, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, um, Taurus, Virgo, Sagittarius, Libra energies here, I feel, Gemini, Aquarius, Cancer um, is here. All right, guys, so that's what I have for you, and I will be speaking with you soon.